Guys, the time has come. If uh, some of you follow me on Instagram, you'll already know where I'm going. But I'm shipping out today Tatanka, my superintendent, to England for a Southern England, all of Spain, and Morocco adventure. Hi, hi Florida Outdoor Adventures. Hope you're well. Keep adventuring. Today I'm driving, I'm, I'm riding Tatanka to the motorcycle shipping company here in Miami that's going to ship it overseas to, uh, to the United Kingdom, London to be exact. And that's where my epic adventure starts. Let me share the details with you guys. The bike is going overseas in a container in a, in a ship and uh, I'm giving it plenty of time to get there. I'm giving it two or three months. It's only going to take three weeks hopefully. Later on this year I'm going to fly over to London. I'm going to pick up the motorcycle. I'm using a company that Charlie Cinewan recommended and so far they've been top-notch. Everything has been uh, seamless. We're going to go right now and drop off the bike. Let's see how that goes. The plan is to land in London and on that Monday I'm going to go to the uh, motor freight company which is very close to Heathrow Airport and meet with Tim or Kathy and, uh, and grab my motorcycle. They're gonna have it ready, charged up, uh, ready to go. There, I have already purchased a ferry uh, that takes me from Portsmouth to Santander, Spain, the north coast of Spain. And from there, I'm gonna take a day to ride east all the way to uh, Galicia, just north of Portugal. There, I'm meeting my three buddies, uh, one of which is the person that uh, invited me on this ride and I feel super lucky that, uh, that I'm able to join on, on their adventure. Ruben, thank you buddy, Alberto, Tocayo and, uh, and Pablo, which I have yet to meet. We're going to hightail it south to Salamanca and then from there to the tip of Gibraltar or I forgot which, which town it is, spend the night and then get the ferry from southern Spain to, to Morocco. Africa and that's where the, the actual adventure <laughs> for me the whole thing is an adventure but for them it's gonna be all of Morocco a big loop through all the uh, important parts and that's it I'm heading out there September mid-September of this year 2018 if anybody happens to be in London on the 9th Sunday the 9th definitely let's grab a beer um, and then Santander, anybody watching from Santander, I'm going to spend the night there once the ferry arrives and uh, just uh, explore a little bit if I have time. I know it's a beautiful city. And then from there, it's all in, uh, in the guys in Spain's hands. Wherever they go, I follow and just enjoy the ride, enjoy the scenery, enjoy the cultures. And I'm very excited. I can't wait. I'm going to miss my motorcycle. It's going to be gone for a while but I'm totally okay with it. You know what it is to ride your own motorcycle in Europe and Africa. That's a dream come true for me and uh, I'm just crossing my fingers that everything just keeps on going as smooth as it has been already. Let's talk a little bit about the maintenance that I did to the motorcycle before, uh, before it goes off to, to the container. I headed over to my buddy Massimo's house, the man from Japan, the greatest mechanic this side of Tokyo. And we put uh, new brakes on the front. The front brakes were actually fine. The rear brake was almost gone. So I'm glad I did that. So new brakes all around. Um, new tires. I put the Shinko 805 and the new Shinko 804 Reflective in the front. Um, what else did I do? I put heated grips, even though I think for this trip, we're not gonna need heated grips, but you never know. But uh, I have bigger plans uh, coming up after Morocco, so I think I'm going to be using the heated grips. Um, 
the oil was fresh, so it only has about 600 miles on the oil, so I didn't change it. I think that's it. All the other maintenance on the motorcycle has been done at Miguel's house or Massimo's or myself. And I think uh, it's ready to go. As far as gear, I'm shipping with the bike in the panniers and in the giant loop uh, tank bag is my, my climb riding gear, my helmets, my tools, my uh, Dyna plug inflator with plugs, uh, my Tricology hammock, which I don't plan on camping, but you never know how the accommodations are going to be. I might end up needing uh, to sleep in my hammock. Some gear that I'm taking over from uh, from Giant Loop to the to the rest of the team, the Morocco team. You'll see that once we set up over there in, uh, in Galicia, Spain. So let's go ahead and get to the uh, to the shipping company, and uh, let's see how how that goes. I'm dropping off my motorcycle to get shipped. Just go around, right? Eh? Okay, thank you. Dropping off my bike, shipping it uh, out. Thanks for watching. Keep your fingers crossed with Tatanka that it makes it before I arrive uh, to England and it's time to celebrate. Cheers. Thanks for all your help too, John. You're good. Yeah. All with you.